A student shot on the way to school. Police say multiple shots were fired. The boy is recovering tonight. And we're learning it was the student's jitney driver who eventually tracked down police. Bob Allen joins us live with new details tonight. Bob. Well, a lot of people heard gunshots in the neighborhood early this morning. Now police are hoping someone will step forward with information needed to make an arrest. Dave Jenkins starts early every morning. About seven. They're ready to go right on the rack. Cooking a variety of meats on an outdoor grill for his barbecue restaurant at Braddock and Hamilton Avenues. But it happened right there. He'll never forget what he saw about 30 feet away. Uh, well, it was a lot of gunshots, and they was over there, right there where the cone is. They were shooting. People was running and ducking, and police was here immediately. When it was over, a 17-year-old male was lying on the ground with a gunshot wound in the back. We have a teenager, a 17-year-old male, who is still in the hospital, last reported to be in critical condition after being shot this morning on Hamilton Avenue. It appears the victim was getting a ride with a jitney when he was shot. Police are asking the community for help. Speaking with a detective, they are free to request to be uh, kept anonymous. We'll honor those requests, even though we really need people to step forward. It wasn't the first time Dave Jenkins has been this close to a shooting incident. Right now, police have no suspects and no motive for the shooting. I just think a lot of our young folks are lost. You know what I'm saying? I think that we're lost as a community. Now, the victim has not been identified. A dark sedan was seen leaving the uh, scene of the crime. And meanwhile, police are again asking anyone who has any information about this shooting to give them a call. Reporting live, Bob Allen, KDKA TV News.